Classes will resume tomorrow at Sarah Scott Middle School. Beagle County School Superintendent Danny Tanus confirmed this to News 10 this morning. Tanus sat down with News 10's John Swanner to explain what went into his decision making. He also explains what the district is doing to keep students and staff safe. It was fun while it lasted, but this dismissal is the last these Sarah Scott Middle Schoolers will see at Riley Elementary School. No longer will they have to make these long bus rides to and from as their school reopens on Wednesday. 84 bats have left the building, leaving it bat free. We're good to go. I can't wait. One thing off the plate. Superintendent Danny Tanu says the health department cleared Sarah Scott for classes after Monday night's final bat count turned up empty. Also, a pair of inspectors went through the entire building. The uh, health department sent two inspectors in yesterday who went through everything. I was there and they went through every nook and cranny, as they say. So how did their time at Riley go for these Scotties? A couple of parents told me off camera and on social media it went well. Others question how much actual learning took place. Tanu said Scotty teachers prepared lessons well in advance and the school corporation sent whatever supplies were needed to help make those lessons possible. I think that uh, overall it wasn't the optimum, but under the circumstances it was fantastic and I believe teachers did a lot of great teaching and students did a lot of good learning. He says students at both schools enjoyed their time together, though they were kept separately most of the school day. From the sounds of things, though, it seems these Scotties are ready to roam their own halls. In Riley, I'm John Swanner, News 10. Dr. Tanu said parents should receive a phone message from their principals. That will have more details about tomorrow's school day.